Hello people and welcome. Today we are sharing what we spent in a week living here in Toronto. We will share about our weekly expenses as a family of two and give you an idea about the cost of living here in this vibrant city. Let's get started. <music> The other day I saw this on the news and it was like, oh, is it true? Is it real? Because I could not believe my eyes how expensive Toronto has been. So I want to share with you my weekly expense and then you can see and compare and have your own opinion about the real cost of living here in this beautiful city of Toronto. So let's dive into our expenses for the week. Here is an overview of the categories we will be talking about. Our biggest expense is so far our rent. We pay around $2,700 per month in our apartment, but it comes with utilities, meaning the electricity, water, and internet, they are all included in this price, heating as well, which comes to about $687 per week. Then we have our groceries. First of all, I want to take you to go and explore a little bit with us around the place we go to do groceries and then I will come to talk to you a little bit more about it. We're going to do groceries and we paid for the gas in our car $62. Now let's go. Remember to always scan your item before placing it in the tray area. Please continue scanning. For we are at Walmart and sometimes we can find Brazilian products. For example, feijão, that's our black beans, you see? Feijão. And then guava sweet it's like so yummy and most importantly sometimes you find guarana that's a brazilian drink it's a miracle finding it here we had to buy the guarana right and we paid here 22 dollars depending on the week the average is 140 dollars per week in groceries and these include the fresh produce meat and other staples we want to buy here and there let me know in the comments below what you think so far about the cost of living here in Toronto if you agree that's expensive or you think it's cheaper from the place you were coming from now let's talk about transportation we use the public transit and our car as we use a mix and we don't go out essentially every day we basically work from home but we have things to do here and there and we can say that we spend roughly $30 per week on transportation and here and there we want to treat ourselves so we order food and usually it's around $30 per week sometimes of course more sometimes less so if we go for example to a restaurant we know that we will spend more money than $30 and some weeks we don't order food at all so we just eat what we have and we cook we prepare our own meals and yeah this is our expense like ordering food weekly and we have to include here the various expense we have for example trips to dollarama oh it's something that we always do i mean I always find something that, oh, this can be useful. And then we buy, we think that's cheap, and then we ended up adding, you know, here and there. So let's say that roughly we spend like $30 weekly, not at dollar amount only, but, you know, buying a gift that some weeks we buy, some other weeks we don't buy for someone's, you know, birthday or a small thing here and there. So let's say that with various things, we can spend like around $30 weekly. Let's add up our total expense. I'm nervous. So with rent, we said before 687 and then we have groceries around 140, transportation 30, dining out or ordering food 30, various 30 and then weekly roughly we pay around 
$917 for a couple to live here in Toronto per week okay but this is not the entire cost we have to save money and also pay for mobile subscriptions here and there gym we don't pay but we know that some people do some people have like extra insurance like car insurance home insurance life insurance private health insurance right like including dental so this can vary so up this total value that's like the average you have to add up because you have other costs as well all right as you can see it's a bit expensive but we really enjoy living here we came from the uk and it was expensive as well i don't know where you're from or what your thoughts so, so let me know in the comments below how your weekly expense compare thank you so much for watching please leave your like and subscribe if you didn't yet see you in our next videos and bye